For months, Barack Obama supporters have worried that race could be a decisive factor in November's election. Now, in crucial battleground states like Ohio, they're hoping it will. With just days to go before Americans cast their ballots, the black community is energized and likely to be a potent political force come Election Day. At Friendship Baptist Church in Toledo, the enthusiasm is palpable. If you saved, you got to vote. We do not want to go through back where we was. Federal law prohibits churches from supporting a candidate or party from the pulpit. But in many black churches across Ohio and America, they don't have to. A recent University of Cincinnati poll showed 94 percent of Ohio blacks said they would support Obama in November's election. That's about 10 points higher than the black vote John Kerry got in 2004. The fact that we've had the first, you know, serious African-American candidate, all of that has, you know, added to the excitement and the interest, I think. Excitement and interest evidenced by the historic voter registration numbers. In Toledo alone, black turnout in this year's March primary more than doubled the number in 2004. And with new early voting laws in Ohio and other key states, blacks are expected to come out this election in numbers not seen in decades, if ever. It's an opportunity the Obama campaign is not taking for granted, as it makes an unprecedented push to get every supporter to the polls. You put your signature here. George Bush won Ohio by just two points in 2004, with Obama and John McCain locked in a neck-and-neck -neck battle. Heavy turnout by black voters could swing the state blue. I'm not going to let you down. Okay. In a state like Ohio and Virginia, which are closely contested, a point or two could be all the difference. Ohio's 20 electoral votes are crucial for McCain, who needs to counter any upsurge in black voters with a strong showing of his base. We must win Ohio on November the 4th. While the Obama camp is optimistic about increasing the black turnout, it's also cautious. We've seen this in the past where expectations haven't met reality. This time it may be a little bit different in part because of the fact that young people and African Americans are so enthusiastic. Whether that enthusiasm actually translates into votes remains to be seen. Kelly Daschle, The Associated Press.